what's up guys my name is Raheem Moyang and welcome to another vlog in today's video we're going to talk about the five budget friendly activities to do in Toronto with your family during the Christmas and the winter season Toronto celebrates Christmas in a very special and unique way from beautifully decorated buildings malls and families coming together it's truly a magical vibes here in Toronto This rink has been a typical Toronto experience for generations. It is set in the unique urban backdrop of sparkling lights and a large Christmas holiday tree. It costs $15 to rent the adult skates and $10 for the kids skates and $5 for the helmet. Bring your families, friends and loved ones and make magical memories on ice that you all will cherish for years to come. It's really, really hard, but it's really, really fun as well, guys. <laughs> what do you think? I think I need to do that. <laughs> Next activity we have is exploring and taking pictures at the Nathan Phillips Square. This is where the famous Toronto sign is located. Beautiful to see day and night, and it's a photo hotspot. Thousands of people go there just to take pictures in front of the beautiful Toronto sign. It's nice to see families with children capturing and enjoying moments, definitely priceless. So we just finished skating, it was really really fun. It's super cold today so make sure you get you guys dressed warm. Yeah, that was so much fun guys, like we had a good time me and the family. Now let's go to the next location guys. The next activity we have is playtime with the family at the rec room. So we just arrived at the next location, our next budget friendly location. At this place, there's a COVID safety protocol. You need your proof of vaccine and you have to wear your mask. So we're gonna get our ticket to play some game now guys. So there's some self-serve machines where you just probably insert your credit card and depending on the amount of credits you want to, Depending on what fun you want to have, you can get tags as cheap as $10 up to $50 and keep in mind the tags are non-transferable so if two people come you each need your own tag. They said if two people use one tag you can have your tags cancelled so keep that in mind guys. Now we're gonna go play some game me and the family. Come on guys let's go have some fun. The rec room redefines the meaning of fun with over 40,000 square feet of great games, malt water and eats, and amazing entertainment, all packed under one roof. Virtual reality, arcade games, live entertainment, and many more. The rec room is the ultimate gathering place to grab a pint or just play. Thank you. This one's a taco. This is one of the taco? Yeah. Thank you. Food is here. For food, we had chicken and waffle fries, which cost $12, and Jamaican taco for $7. That was so much fun, guys. We had a wonderful time. Me and the entire family were playing a lot of games, and it only cost us $35. Like, it was so much fun. We eat some food, we had some drinks. We had a wonderful time here, guys. Now, let's head to the next budget friendly activity that you can do in Toronto during the winter and the Christmas season. Let's go. So at the end of the day, you can come to Dundas Square. It's a very popular area. It's like mini Manhattan in Toronto. Yeah, it's such a beautiful place. A lot of lights, a lot of people moving. You can just sit here and have a hot chocolate and just relax. You and the family can just chill out. It's the winter time. But you still can come outside and get some air and embrace. You know? What's going on? Mm -hmm. 
Next activity is exploring the distillery district. The distillery district is Toronto's most magical holiday experience. It's free to get in from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. And on the weekends and specific days, it's $8 to get in after 4 p.m. Okay, so our next pit stop on this location will be the distillery district. It's an old whiskey factory and now they've turned it into a pedestrian Christmas wonderland. So we're gonna go around with our little family and get some nice little hot chocolate to warm us up on this cold day and take you along with us. right now she knows but mine tastes okay but hers is the best i recommend the baileys hot chocolate what do you think yeah i agree the baileys hot chocolate is good but the only thing you have to stay because it has alcohol you have to stay within this perimeter and finish your alcoholic beverage and then you can explore the rest of the market but for the most part it's delicious <laughs> you like yours mommy Want yours? Mama doesn't want hers, it's too regular. She wants the daily one. She wants a pretty cup. <laughs> no. Yeah, I know you. <laughs> I hope you find this video insightful and that was my top 5 recommendation for budget friendly activities to do in Toronto. My name is Rahim Mulyam and I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one. Thank Don't you. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share to your boy Thank <laughs> down you. below, okay? Appreciate that. <laughs> Thank you to all my new subscribers that have joined my YouTube family and the ones that have been here since day one. 2021 has been a great year and I'm looking forward to creating new memories with you in 2022. Love you all and a happy new year.